Now, despite the abuse the Nintendo Wii gets, it does have some classic games. Mario Galaxy, Wii Fit, Mario Kart Wii, even Super Mario Bros. Wii. They're all great games. Your Zeldas, all fantastic titles. I'm going to be looking at the more obscure titles on the Wii and tell you what I think about them. Today, it's going to be Trivial Pursuit. Let's do this. Okay, create profile. Great, excellent. Okay. That's a horrendous beard. Look at his eyebrows. Hey, eyebrows? Amazing. Is Is that a rabbit? Still got the same eyebrows. all day. Nice mullet. I think I'm going to go with a pirate. If in doubt, go for the pirate. That's what I always say. Oh. Oh. David Bowie. <laughs> I hope this uh, character select screen is as exciting in the game. Feeling this is as exciting as this game is going to get, folks. Pirated it. Uh, ass. No. Always ass. Oh, I can't, can't choose that. Ass. Man. Ass man. Don't have ass man. Nope. We already taken. Or swear words. Just go with default. It's making me choose a boring name. Oh, I can't even do an eye. Jeez. Right. Where's the K? Yes. Ugh. Annoying. Yes. Right, that's me. Profile. Yes, pirate, Nick. Ah, space changes. Ha. Ha. Yarr. No idea what this means. Go back. The of the game is to be first player to collect six category wedges and then correctly answer one final question. Okay, I'm going to keep the tutorial on. Let me play. Spin the wheel by pressing A or by flicking the wheel remote left or right. Spinning. Okay. So, spin the wheel. Here we go. Okay, what's our first category? Okay. Yeah. Uh, get that. That's fine. Okay, art and literature. Science and Nature. I've got 500 chips if I want to buy. I'll go with Science and Nature. I watched a good David Attenborough documentary last night, so hopefully one of those questions will be featured in here. Okay, she's told me I think I'm going to stable this tutorial because I'm just going to risk it. Yep, thank you. Okay, cans. In a extreme sports, British. Why? How, how is science and nature in extreme sports? British matters, Roman Empire. Cans sounds good. No, nope, nope, running out of time. There we go. Cans. Okay, where's my question? I have no idea. Uh, maybe I should have disabled the circle rail. 220, yep. Yeah. Illness known to cause problems with the nervous system might be contracted by eating food from a damaged can. Salmonella? No, it's wrong. Oh, botulism, of course. No, so I betted that I'd get it right and I didn't. So I've lost money there. 
Will again. Oh, it's exciting. Okay. History. Actors, dangerous animals, career day, the Beatles. Okay, well, I'm from Liverpool, so I'll go with the Beatles. Right, I'm betting on when I'm going to get it right or wrong. Um, I can only seem to get it right. Okay. Fairly confident, so I'm going to lock it in. Uh, I think it might have been I want to hold your hand. Oh, yeah! 40. Spin, spin, spin! Church categories. Ugh. Okay. No! Oh, it's exciting. Sports and leisure. History. Oh, I might buy. I might buy a category. Um, entertainment. Yep, pink. Entertainment. Okay. Let's And spin! Exciting! Okay! Blue! Is it blue? Okay, did I have to land on that? Oh no, I've got a wedge! Okay, science and nature. Let's see if we can get this one this time. Okay, mm. End of the world! The Mayans couldn't predict it, let's see if I can. Uh, put the boat out. 30 monies. Lock it in. Bob. Zoom. <laughs> yes! Beautiful! What a fantastic question. I couldn't get this wrong. No! Nope. Looks like I got it wrong. No, I actually selected 2013, but it gave me the answer anyway. Alright! Get in! Three already. Spin, spin, spin. I stuck in there a couple of times. Let's have a look. Ooh. Art and literature. Monty Python. I imagine that's on art and literature. Oh yes, I love Monty Python. That's the question about that. I'm confident. I like it, but uh, I've seen a lot of it. I think that was Terry Gilliam. Yeah! Woo! Got it right. Look at that. Getting all the wedges. Should have put more money on it. Two more wedges to go. So what do I need? I need... Geography one. Yellow. I've already got one of those. Let's get a. Uh, well, I've got an orange one. Oh, sports and leisure. That's rubbish. Red. Okay, I'll go with red because I like that colour. I need a red. Uh, what? I, the topic is red. Things that are red. Okay. Press boxes, phone boxes, fire engines, I don't know. Uh, okay, okay, which time is right and what? Well, no idea. Uh, random? Oh, I didn't get it. How will I ever live? Why did I put 20 on it? Can you blue? How can you tell? It's just random. Okay. Got pink. Got green. I'm going to go science and nature again. Babies, roadside America, they live in public. What? 
shopping. Babies! Oh, you can just, you don't have to put bets on it, you can just go straight. Which river is famously never seen in New York City? Sparrow? No. A pigeon. Oh, you never see a pigeon, I don't suppose. Rubbish. There are plenty of pigeons in New York. You don't see them, they're not there. Pink. I've got pink. Annoying. We need blue. Let's go for geography. I will get, I will get a wedge. I will code Cooper Crawley's Mars and Wales. Well, Mark will want me to go here. Yeah, let's go. For, okay, Mark. Bye. Can I find a friend? I think I'm gonna bet on that. I'm gonna get it right. Lock it in. Uh, left. It's for the left. So west. Left. Yeah! <laughs> yes. Mr. McCrone, Mr. Craven will not be disappointed that I got that right. Okay. Let's take a look. Spin. Imagine this is even more fun with more players. I haven't really used the Wii mode yet. Just moving around. Okay, I need orange. Sports and leisure. Okay, bubbles, blue peter, social media, and butter. Okay, sports and leisure, butter, butter. Are they related? I have no idea. Okay, I'm gonna go with butter. I like butter. Okay. Lock it in. What is the main ingredient in the middle of this tahini? I think it's yogurt. Oh, sesame seeds! Rubbish! Screw job. Right. Okay, I need an orange. Uh, orange! Oh! Good. Keep moving around with throwing the Wii mode across the room. I mean. No, I, want to buy, I can't buy it, so I'm going to go with entertainment. Put Wales again. I'm quite good at that. Wow, that's a little chips. Okay, I like cheese. Butter did not fail. <laughs> not do well with butter, but I like cheese. I'm going to lock it in. Okay, they don't sell cheetos in this country, so let's... Ch ch chair? Chaz? No, Chester, of course. Yes, Chubby Pursuit being an English game, I'm glad we asked an American question. Rubbish. Spin! Spin, 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 Ow! Oh, green, a bad green. Give me orange. Science and nature again. Tacky. This game's tacky, so we'll do that. Okay. I'm gonna lock it in. No, no, you can put it back. I'm gonna lock it in. A 3M product resulted when a scientist tried out a replacement for way with... What? Post-it notes. Yes! <laughs> Random guesses for the win! Yeah! Correct. And we'll get that purple. I mean, orange. Spin! Ow. Okay. I don't need any of those. Go with the same again. Studs, chili, trees. Yes, let's talk about trees. Yeah, 
just gonna go straight up. We're at 20 on treats. What might it feel? It's not horror. What? Oh, of course! I'm an idiot. Why didn't I read the question properly? Probably why I'm screwing this up. I really need an orange. Okay, spin! Spin, spin, spin! Ah, oh, an orange at last! Sports and leisure. Come on. Ooh, 80s movies. Definitely. Let's hope it's Ghostbusters. Fuck it in. What game shares its name with the gentle fairy giant that accompanies Sarah through the maze in the film Labyrinth? Everyone's probably shouting at the creed. Ludo! Yes! I've only seen that film once when I was eight. And I got it right. Yes! Final category, I get to choose. Okay folks, which one did we do best at? I have no idea what these numbers mean, I think that's what I win. Uh, entertainment, I think I did the best at. Bowie! Oh, rap, brilliant. I'm glad you've locked all these ones out that I could have won. Okay, rap. Prepping. Prep, prep, prepping. Okay, what New York neighbourhood was Sean Coombs born in? So, he's... Pete Diddy, Pete Diddley, Harlem. Yeah! <laughs> I've done it! Woo! It wins! That's right. Look at the fireworks. Look at the graphics. Stunning. Okay. Game stats. Look at all that. I failed. Oh, I don't mind show the entertainment because I've, it's one of the worst topics I've had. Max Chips, get in. Play again. Main menu, please. So, that was Trivial Pursuit. Not bad, better than I thought. Bit of fun. I imagine it'd be a bit more fun if you just played with other people. Online mode, maybe, could have been an advantage, but being the way it's not been the best online uh, thing. Anyway, 6 on 10. Not great, but not bad either. That's it for this week's episode, but don't forget to tune in next time. Subscribe if you like what you see. Don't forget to uh, put your comments and your likes in the box below, and uh, we'll see you next time.